Hey guys, what is up? Hi, hello, my name is John and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm super excited. We're going to be playing with Color Beauty Self-Adjusting Foundation. What? Is this black magic you ask? Probably. So this foundation is with SPF 50. The self-adjusting foundation applies to the skin white then self-adjusted to match your skin tone. It is designed to moisturize and even out your complexion while also providing your skin with protection containing SPF 50. The foundation protects your skin against harmful UV rays, helping to minimize premature skin aging caused by sun. And that's the tea. And I think the only reason that they have two shades is that it's supposed to adjust to your skin. So if you have a deep, deep, dark complexion, I think the medium is supposed to adjust to your complexion. Well, I think that's how it's supposed to work. So let's read the directions. Apply 15 minutes before sun exposure. Reapply at least every two hours. I mean, does anybody do that? Because this hoe doesn't. And children under six months as a doctor. Why the hell would you put this on a baby? So if they're seven months, it's okay. I got this foundation on Color Beauty's Amazon store, but I'm sure you can buy this on their actual website. Uh, with Amazon, I got this next day. So this foundation was $39.95. I wanted to get the medium uh, shade, but they ran out. Um, and it wouldn't be in stock until I think the 25th or the 26th. But as I'm looking on their website, um, it's saying in stock. So I've been bamboozled. <laughs> it's in a plastic bottle and it looks like this. I already have my clips in my hair. So let's go ahead and use the Benefit Pore Professional. I, I hate this name. Let's prime our little mug. Today I had the biggest headache and I didn't know why, like I took Advil and I still had a horrible ass headache, but then you know what it was? I haven't had coffee in two days. And no joke, after drinking coffee within like five minutes, my headache went away. So I think a hoe might be addicted. Goodness. A few moments later. Sweetie. Okay. Oh, look, it's white. It's really, um, it's thick. It kind of has a baby, um, or has a lotion kind of smell. Okay, we're gonna use my Fenty foundation brush, so let's see. Is it doing anything? Do you guys see? Oh my god, I missed like this top. Okay, I think, what is it? Is it doing anything? Okay, let's try to apply more. And the smell isn't too bad. It's, it's there, but it's tolerable. It smells clean, so if you like the clean smell. And it's blending out beautifully. It seems cakey now. Maybe I put way too much. But it said it's buildable. Does it look like my shade? We're gonna take this beauty blender and we're just gonna try to smooth it out. Let's see, did it adjust to my skin tone? I think it did. Okay, so I'm gonna take my Fenty concealer. And I'm gonna take my new Givenchy loose setting powder and we're gonna put it all over my mug. Use my NARS bronzer. Is 
Then we're gonna go with my Natasha Denona cheek palette. Okay, so I think foundation looks pretty good. Um, it definitely has a dewy look to it. Um, and it still has that tacky feeling. So we're gonna do a wear time test and I will be back in a minute. Hey guys, what is up? I am back and it's been about four hours. So the foundation is still pretty sticky. Um, the tacky feeling has not gone away and it has disappeared around my nose. And also, the foundation has settled into like my fine lines around here and on my forehead. And I've never had that issue with the other foundations that I've used. And I just stayed around the house today. I didn't really even do much. Um, the puppies and I went outside for walks and that was it. So I didn't go to the store or put my mask on for it to be rubbed off. But yeah, I think the foundation is pretty cool where it adjusts to your skin tone. So that's awesome. But for me, it's just okay. Um, it is lightweight feeling and I didn't get that itchy feeling or tingly feeling like I did with the Morphe foundation. So yeah, guys, what do you think? How does it look on me? I did this eye look because I'm filming another video. Um... But let me know what you think. Thank you so much for joining me today. And before you go, sis, if you could hit that thumbs up and also subscribe, I would appreciate it. All right, thank you guys so much. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.